native Will Collier has qualified for the National High School Finals Rodeo. For the third year in a row, no less, he's got an army of people supporting him from the community to family and friends. We had a chance to catch up with him yesterday. Steer wrestling yeah, Will. Yeah, Will. is Will Collier's passion. And preparations are full on for his third consecutive trip to the National High School Finals Rodeo in less than two weeks. A slow start to this season, says Collier, but heating up down the stretch. We was just trying to, you know, get together and get flowing and everything. But towards the middle end of the season, we really started clicking and then just fought our way back. Third place at the state finals rodeo in 2021, the state champion a year ago and reserve champ in 2023. Collier's no stranger to the big stage. It helps a lot being under pressure. The main thing in competing in that is consistency. Because if you miss a steer, you're falling back. You know, you got to catch every steer and throw them all. Once you're there, you just got to relax and take it in. That's something Collier has been doing since he started the sport. Only three years ago, the motivation coming from a pretty clear place. My dad. He's the one that taught me everything and uh, got me started. I was six years old, went to my first rodeo, seen a bronc rider and said, man, I want to do that. And and God opened doors for me and I was able to do it and have a pretty, pretty good career. My thing with Will, I never wanted to push him because I didn't want him to do it because I wanted him to do it. I wanted him to do it because he wanted to. And about three years ago, we went to my buddy's practice pen and he ran, I think, four steers and didn't catch one of them. He got down on two of them and wrecked. And we got in the truck and his eyes lit up. He said, man, I love it. He said, that's what I want to do. And I said, you bet. The first time I met him was right when he was getting started. We practiced over to Barn West of here during the winter. And he was absolutely just getting drugged around, man. But he never quit. And once I did it, I just fell in love with it. I never caught a steer until I was at my first high school rodeo. It just kind of happened. I won the rodeo and I was like, all right, I can I kind of get used to this. We just tried to blow wind behind him and, and help him every step we can. We had nothing to begin with. We had no arena. We had no horses. We didn't have the truck, the trailer. And so we just built fence and just worked and little by little just did what we could to support him and to help him to be successful. Monica also plays a big role in organizing donations that help Will from the surrounding community. Something the Colliers can't express enough gratitude for. My parents have done everything they could. Pushed me in the right way and just kept me going, kept me uplifted. I wouldn't trade it for anything. All of it has Will ready for nationals round three man it's been a dream come true we've helped each other out all we could and that's what it takes you know you got to have your people behind you to take you where you need to go i'm his biggest fan too so i'm excited and proud of him kind of going in there with just the right mindset i know i can do it but i gotta believe i can do it don't get in my head don't get nervous just go back to the basics and just do what's right well the national high school finals rodeo begins july 16th in Gillette, Wyoming, just less than two weeks away. Will and his family head out later this week to get there. He actually has four rodeos next week, just leading up to that one. It's a crazy stretch for him. But in steer wrestling, the top 20 advance to the short finals round for a chance at the championship. We're all rooting for Will that he's able to do that.